Covered strain of the coronavirus has prompted shutdowns and travel restrictions across Europe. Scientists say that the mutated virus found in the United Kingdom may be spreading faster. As Couple Lands Washington, D.C. correspondent Raquel Martin reports, White House public officials say that they are not shocked by the discovery, but warn that it could come here next. We could have that same type of escape mutant here. Dr. Deborah Burks warns a newly discovered and possibly more contagious strain of the coronavirus could soon make it to the U.S. Do Americans need to be worried? We really need to be vigilant to be watching for this. But what we do know is we know what we know, how, we know we can prevent transmission. Early research shows the new strain of COVID discovered in England spreads faster, but there is so far no evidence it's more deadly. All the vaccine manufacturing companies are looking very closely to see if this particular strain is still, um, the vaccine is still effective against that. For now, Burke says those who can should get vaccinated immediately. These vaccines are going to save so many lives. Tuesday, Health and Human Services Secretary Alex Azar and Dr. Anthony Fauci became the latest officials to publicly take a shot in the arm. I feel extreme confidence in the safety and the efficacy of this vaccine. But Michigan Democratic Senator Debbie Stabenow says she remains concerned about the vaccine supply in her state and others. She hopes billions in new funding from the latest COVID relief package will help. This is an ongoing effort that needs to be addressed to get the job done. It really needs to get to all of our frontline health care providers. Burke says the goal remains to have 20 million Americans vaccinated by the end of the month. Although the most optimistic schedules predict most Americans will not get their vaccine until the spring or summer. In Washington, Raquel Martin. And Dr. Burke says that he's encouraging Americans to continue to wear a mask, social distance, and to not gather in large groups to avoid spreading the virus this holiday season.